Hello everyone. Today in this video, I'll be discussing about GeoCraft Business Directory Listing WordPress theme. And in my previous uh, videos, I have discussed about its preview, theme option panel, and um, how exactly a person can come to your website to put up his business listing on your website. And also, I discussed about the price package setting that we can put on your website um, so that you can charge your customers for. Uh, putting their business listings on your website so particularly in this video today I'll be discussing about the transaction section okay and also the lead capture and the export import option that we have got on our geocrop WordPress theme okay so let's get started for that we'll come here at our WordPress dashboard and uh, again you can go to this geocrop setting and then you will find this custom fields option over here you can see these are the custom fields that we have got on our website listing title address contact name select image so if you want to uh, put up a new custom field okay if you want to add a new custom field on your website you can just go here at add custom field okay and then you can uh, put up the field type text whether it be text uh, geo map multi checkbox radio select text area or image uploader you can give a name to this field you can uh, put up the HTML variable name and uh, just uh, notice this that it should be a unique name and it will not be editable after once you have entered it all right then you can provide some description and it will appear beside the field next to the field then you can put the default value of the custom field and then you can enter the position the display order for example you can uh, put the display order like five or six and it will be shown in the fifth or the sixth order okay depending upon its position uh, then active yes or no if you want to show this up on the website then you can put the status as active yes or else you can put it as no then required if you choose this field as required then the person will not be able to proceed until unless he fills that particular field okay if you choose it as no then he can just uh, leave this field and he will be able to proceed even if he leaves this field blank okay so that is the required one and uh, then show on detail page whether you want to show this custom field on the detail page yes or no I'll just show you pop in spatisserie you can see these are the custom fields means upload we have uploaded image uh, we have put up the social links address contact name time phone number and everything so you want this particular custom field to appear in this detail page then you can choose yes or no from here and do you want to enable this for free listing because we noticed that uh, in many uh, free listings these social icons and address and everything was not coming it is coming only for the premium one so whether you want to show this particular custom field for a free listing then you can choose pre listing from here and save all changes so that is how you can add the custom field then you have got transaction as you know we have got different packages so the person uh, when he'll be choosing a premium package and he will be making the transaction all those transaction uh, details will be formed here okay then you have got leads capture I'll show you you have got this lead capture form just I'll put up a name any number and a message I'll enter the capture Q Q E Z G <laughs> okay send all right so I have sent the message now when I'll click here you will find this new entry you can see name Raj email contact number and message and the listing title it is uh, of Poppins Petisserie. All right, so this is how you will be able to view the leads capture over here. Also, the person who have put up that particular uh, listing will be able to view the lead capture as well. For example, he is logged into your website and he can just go here at leads capture and view it. You can see from here he can view the leads, my leads. So that is how the a user or the customer who have put up that particular listing will be able to view the leads capture that are coming on his forms then you have got this import export you can completely export all the details or every single detail of this listings that you have got on your website into a simple CSV file I'll just show you just click here on export to CSV all right it is downloaded I'll open it 
here you go okay so can you see here the post author post title uh, post content category you've got tags post status you got feature and you can see what is it is it uh, the free package or the pro package you can view every single detail over here every single detail that you have uh, put on your website that you have got on your website about the listings about the business listing you will find here in this simple csv file all right and then again you have got the option to import a csv file and you can choose the file from here and import as well so that is the custom fields transaction leads capture and import export option that we have got in the geocraft setting i hope the series of demo will help you to work out with geocraft theme and it is a very very simple and systematic theme that you have got and you can create an amazing website amazing directory listing website and you can see it looks absolutely fantastic so this is it this is geocraft and try this for sure because it's a very good platform to make money and it's also a very good platform for others to promote their services so you can help someone and you will be helped by making some money so thanks so much for watching and enjoy creating websites with ink themes thank you